Thanks, Rico. Hey, class, how are you guys doing today? Good. Awesome. Did you have a good weekend? Yeah. Awesome. Okay, so today we're going to be talking about weather and climate. And um, does anybody know the best place to go to get the most accurate weather forecast? The telecast? Yep, weather.gov. Good. And that is also known as, what is that logo? Uh, Noah, good. Excellent. So, what I'm going to do is pop up the forecast. Does anybody remember, anybody remember our zip code? Awesome. Okay. And does anybody know what happened to Ms. Costa's remote? Yeah, I'll put it somewhere. Right there. Right there. Of course. Thanks, guys. Okay. Awesome. So, basically, 27320, and I want to volunteer. Raise your hand. Hands. Okay, so who really, really wants to go up here and tell us the broadcast for the week? Forecast for the week. Ooh. You really look like you want to. Okay, Brennan, go! Go, go tell the class what's going to happen. Starting with this afternoon to Sunday night. Thanks to the volunteer. You can go ahead and do something next. Thanks, Katie. Ooh, start on this afternoon, we got 20% chance of uh, storms. And then tonight, we'll get 30 percent slash 20 percent chance of storms and one chance of showers. All right. And then starting Saturday, we'll have 30 percent chance of rainfall and 40 percent chance of cloud cover or thunderstorms. I guess that's what that is. And um, the highs will be 91. So make sure you dress up where it's going to be warm outside, of course. And then Saturday night, we'll have 50 percent chance of storms. The low will be 70 degrees, so it's going to be kind of chilly. Sunday, uh, it's going to be 60%, 60 chance both ways, shower is likely, then uh, thunderstorms, it's going to be, the high will be 85, and then Sunday night it's going to be 60% chance of thunderstorms, and then 64 will be below. Excellent job, give a round of applause. All right, that was great, Brandon, seriously, for not even knowing and going with it, that's excellent. Now, Katie, would you like to read the little forecast summary? It's two sentences, three sentences. Let us know about the uh, system's high and low pressure. It's right here. Would you like to read this little part right here? And then we will call it a day. And you guys can take your little exit tickets with you. Okay, awesome. You sure? Yep. Okay, cool. So, right here is basically what's really going on and it causes the weather. Okay, so whenever you're ready. A weak cold front to the north of the region will drop south today, stalling across the Virginians tonight, then retreating north as a warm front on Saturday. A strong cold front will move across the Ohio Valley Saturday, Saturday then through the mid-Atlantic region Sunday. Drier and somewhat cooler weather is expected the next week following Sunday's frontal passage. Excellent job! All right, give her a round of applause! Okay, so... We have two fronts. Which ones? Blank and blank. Anybody can answer. Cold and warm. Good. Cold and warm. Excellent. You all got this. So what you're going to do is use your weather and climate sheets you have at your desk as your exit ticket for today. And you're going to put a W for what is description of weather and a C for what's description of climate. Remember, weather is short term and climate is what? Long term. Long term weather. Good job, guys. Excellent. Have a great day. Thank you.